Khalifa of Muslimin, why, why you, you fail to protect that woman or even the, the beast of that woman, the donkey that she was riding? Why haven't you paved the road in such a way that this poor donkey won't get hurt? If this is the thinking of Umar, do you expect that he will leave this for his son? So this adl, this injustice, inequality, all these things are addressed by this list. This is a very general statement that, that fulfill Allah's uh, ahd, which is the uh, whatever contractually Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made contract with us to worship Him. So it falls under it so many things actually. Allah's ahad, Allah's the testimony that we had, our allegiance, our bondage with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. It falls so many things. So let's try to fulfill these uh, obligations and the duties of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And final verse I would like to end up my discussion with that that this is my Salat al-Mustaqim this is my Salat al-Mustaqim Salat al-Mustaqim is a straight path a straight path that leads to happiness that leads to prosperity that leads to salvation that leads to Jannah and it is full of wisdom this this negative list that I have described is very clear any human being will be happy will feel rejoiced when he receives this list because this list is the source of happiness and this is the Salat al-Mustaqim. So follow it. Follow this Salat al-Mustaqim and don't follow the various other ways that takes you away from this highway, straight way. Because that will not bring you happiness. It will bring you hardship. You try to, you will, you will think that I am, I am doing well in one area, then problem arises from other areas because, because it's not Salat al-Mustaqim. The distance has increased, the hardship has increased. You, will, you cannot reach from A to B with a carved and crooked way as you can reach it when you take a straight way. And when you take a carved way, you, you, you live only one life, okay? So you cannot say that, okay, I'm on an experimental uh, basis here. You never know when the death comes to you. So uh, there is no way to experiment here. Tafarraqa bikum an sabili. Because very likely you will get l lost. You will never reach B. You will end up in a desert, thirst thirsty and feeling hungry and you might be eaten up by a wild beast and so many of them is out there so don't experiment all these verses ends with that this is Allah's advice Allah's wasiya Allah's wasiya which the Prophet ﷺ conveyed to us through this Quran so let's take Allah's wasiyah. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.